Dr. Behe, are there limits to natural science? If so, how do they impact our understanding of origins? There are limits to natural science. Natural science can only uh, investigate material processes and uh, matter and motion. And uh, to the extent that there are other things which really exist, which are not material processes, which are not matter and motion, then science cannot investigate those things. And again, to the extent that uh, non-physical uh, beings or non-physical processes were involved in uh, originating the universe and originating life or in any other uh, event affecting things in the universe, science will have a difficult time, that is, an impossible time uh, uh, to investigate those. That does not mean, however, that science can't draw some conclusions. They can, uh, scientists can uh, see uh, the physical world as it is and can make some pretty good um, estimations of what would have had to go into uh, designing the physical world and uh, can conclude, I think, that there is no known process and that uh, the process that uh, was responsible for it is likely to have been something outside the universe. Uh, when one thinks of the Big Bang, uh, one can see that uh, perhaps something outside of the physical universe was required to, to initiate that. And you can extend this reasoning to origin of life chemistry and, and other things as well.